Welcome back. We promised we would show you how we slow cook in our van. What we've done is we use something similar to the Wonder Bag. You may have heard of that. You can buy it. Essentially, it's a insulated sack you put your crock pot in. Um, we wanted something that was a little bit better at holding heat in um, because we're in Canada and sometimes in the wintertime the exterior air of the van can get quite cold. Um, so we created this that we'll refer to as the Wonder Box. Essentially this is one inch polystyrene. Um, we've cut it and glued it together uh, and then added some tape just to make sure it doesn't come apart. We also used the cardboard insert that came with the Dutch oven uh, just to kind of keep it from sliding around inside and to keep it spaced. Then we've coated the inside with Reflectix. You can see here's a bit of a circle for the knob to fit just right. But um, Reflectix gets a bad rap. Um, it's actually very good insulation if you use it for the right things. This box here allows us to put the Dutch oven into it. It has a cork bottom in it to keep the pot from melting the uh, polystyrene. Reflectix works best when there's a bit of a gap because it reflects the infrared heat and it does it to like a 97% effective rate. That means the heat that does actually physically touch the wall goes through quite easily, but the polystyrene will stop that. So together, this actually keeps a lot of heat in the Dutch oven where we want it to be. Um, that being said, once it's filled and hot, we drop it in. We then can put this to stop any air from leaking out. Hot air rises and we want to stop that convection as well as reflect a lot of that heat down. And then from there, the lid goes on and we tighten it down with a ratchet strap so that nothing can escape. And then we leave it for four or five hours, depending on what it is we're doing. Um, and what we have here is a cast iron Dutch oven. Um, it's about three liters this size. We feel that that's about the right size for what we're doing here. Um, we can fit enough food in here for the two of us, maybe with a bit of leftovers, um, but anything bigger. And um, then you've got to store all those leftovers. So that is our Wonderbox.